Good day! In this video, we are going to do question 3B and 3C of the 2021 NCA chance and data paper. Both of these questions are merit questions. So if you can answer them, you'll get two merit in this paper. So without further ado, let's read the question. The graph below shows the total amount of money paid out by ACC for dog-related injuries in each of the years from 2001 to 2018 for Auckland. Auckland is the top one, followed by Christchurch and Wellington. ACC notices a concerning trend from Auckland regarding the amount of money paid out for dog-related injuries compared to Christchurch and Wellington. Give statistical reason why you think ACC should be concerned about the amount of money spent on dog-related injuries in Auckland. Yes, ACC should be worried for the following reason. The gap between the claim for Auckland and Christchurch and Auckland and Wellington is widening since 2010. So 2010, they had increased, Auckland had increased so much and Christchurch had been uh, maintaining and Wellington the same. Okay, Therefore, it is likely to widen even further in the future years if this trend continues. So ACC should be real worried. If you can answer that question, they will give you a merit in this paper and that will give you an M5 for this question. Okay, let's look at question 3C now. Okay, adjust the paper now. Okay, question 3C reads like that. When the amount paid by ACC for dog-related injuries in Auckland is compared for dog-related injuries for the whole of New Zealand, the trend seems similar. Okay, you can see the trend is quite similar. Why is that so? Interpret and explain why these two trends shown in the graph above might have the similar shape. Okay, the trend between New Zealand and Auckland have the same shape because of two main reasons. Auckland is the largest city in New Zealand. It also has the largest population and so they have the largest number of dogs in the city. Therefore, there will be a greater number of dog-related claims in Auckland when compared to other cities. And the second reason is that Auckland contributes the largest proportion for the whole country. So the trend for Auckland dominate the trend for New Zealand. Not only for dog-related injury, but for anything. Okay, If Auckland is bad, the whole country is bad. Auckland is good, everything is going to be good for the whole country because Auckland has one third of the population of New Zealand. That is how you answer question 3C. You can do that. There's another merit and you should be able to pass this paper quite easily. Cheers everyone and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.